Oh, hello and happy Sunday. It is Sunday, January 27th, and I wanted to update you on some stats just from the 20th to the 27th. Uh, it was an interesting week. Um, the last little bit of December, the first week two weeks of January, a little slow, which is totally normal. And then for myself personally, the last uh, week or so, I felt a little bit of activity starting to bubble up. So I think we're just getting people ready to think about listing their homes, we're getting some buyers thinking that springtime is coming, thinking they're gonna wanna get out soon and start peeking around. Uh, so I wanted to share some numbers with you. Um, the video next week will be a little bit more interesting in a sense and that will be into the month of February. So we'll have some things like the actual average discount that people were getting in the month of January. Um, but I ran some numbers and I just wanted to share some of them with you today. Of course, I always sort of talk about the same things. How many new listings, how many homes are pending, how many went uh, officially sold, um, as well as I like to talk about um, average sale price for the homes that had sold that week. And then today I just did a quick check on where we're sitting at inventory wise like how many single family homes are for sale how many condos how many mobiles so I'll share that with you as well so this week from January 20th to the 27th we had uh, 43 new listings and this is just in the Fort McMurray area so I'm not counting Grasslands um, and Plamondon and Lac La Biche. so 43 new listings we had 17 homes get accepted offers, so they're considered pending now. Um, and then from the week or two prior, we had 16 homes go sold. So 16 of those pendings have officially come through to new owners. So something that I just like to do that I've only sort of started to do recently um, is just go through the last week of solds and see what the average sale price was. There was a little bit of a spread this week. We had like um, a vacant land listing sell for the 150s um, and then there was a higher end home in town that uh, sold into the 700s. So, but there was a bunch of mishmash in between. So when I uh, calculated all through it, through those 16, I figured out actually what each home, uh, what sort of discount they got, just for my own knowledge. Um, and then the average sale price, believe it or not, is more around 378. And, and that makes sense because the last couple of weeks when I've been looking, it does seem like between three and 400,000 is a very happy place for people right now. Um, so that was interesting. So when I went to actually check through some inventory levels, um, I personally had a new condo go up uh, for sale here in the last week, or a client, not mine personally. Um, so I was just kind of checking things out. So for single family homes, there's uh, in our area, again, Fort McMurray, there's 319 single family homes for sale currently, as of today. There's 199 condos, uh, and there's only 40 mobiles. So it's Interesting, um, when I figured out the average discount from the ones that had sold this last week, it still looked like it was sitting around 5%. Again, there was like a massive spread. A few places that sold had like a 15 to 18% discounts. And I'm sure there's a lot of factors that go into that that we just won't know. Um, and then, but it looked like for the most part, it was like four, four, three, four, five. Uh, so again, not like huge deep discounts on the bulk of things. So yeah, that was sort of it. So I wanted to share that. And then next week I'll have a better uh, understanding of the full month of January for a better stats month. And then that's it. It is lovely weather today compared to last week. So I hope you're out enjoying either the slopes at Vista Ridge or it's the end of minor hockey week. So I myself am going to some gold medal games this afternoon for some young men that happen to belong to me. So I hope you're having a really good week and I'll see you next Sunday. Bye.